In today's video, I'm going to give you three unusual passive income ideas that I believe anyone could use to take themselves from having zero side hustle income all the way up to plus a hundred pounds a day. Now, as with any side hustle, these do require a little bit of creative power. You have to obviously do stuff in order to generate this passive income. And it could even take you a year or so to get towards a hundred pounds a day or more. But why I'm giving you these three unusual ideas, first of all, you do not need to create a website. I'm gonna show you how to have a business completely independent of having email and a website, all the kind of usual storefront things you might need to do for a side hustle. You're going to use three websites. You've got a choice of whichever one catches your eye. And then you can actually build a business that could actually make you passive income. Now, as for me, I know that I have been using passive income, certainly ways to make passive income in my life for a couple of years now. You're watching one of those income sources for my family. So I work full time and I make YouTube videos and social media and products in my spare time. So if one of these three options seem like the right thing for you, I'm gonna encourage you, drop me a comment below, click subscribe so that I can follow your progress and give this video a thumbs up. But let me know in the comments which one you're going to start, maybe even announce it to the community so that we can check out your business. Hi there, welcome back to the Mama Fur Fur channel. My name is Jennifer, so let's dive straight in. So the very first website I'm going to show you, actually you probably have thought of this before, but the first idea I'm going to give you is actually having a drop shipping business. Now I said the three ways I'm going to describe for you in this video, I'm gonna take you through step by step how I would build a business. I have actually used these exact methods, most of them myself. I used to have a drop shipping business in the past. I made t-shirts and jumpers and it made me some money before I started this YouTube channel. So I know that it works. What you would do is then try and get eyeballs to your store, but let me show you one idea to actually have a drop shipping business. So I'm using Canva and this is what I want you to do. You would use an online publisher such as Canva, such as even Adobe Spark, something like that but we're gonna use Canva. And the whole point is to use a website like Teespring, which is a drop shipping company. They will actually create products using your designs, okay? So what you would do is anyone can do this. It doesn't cost you any money. You obviously pay a little bit of added services fees in the background, but you can actually create items that then Teespring will send directly to your customer. You do not need to produce physical items. You do not need to worry about inventory. They will simply have your website, your front store on their Teespring site. People, when they're searching for designs, will find it. It could be t-shirts, it could be phone cases, as I'll show you a whole host of things. They will then make it and ship it to your customer. Now, the reason I love drop shipping is because, as I said, you're not getting involved in the physical items. Now, this is one business, as you know, in recent times as well, people like unique things. And I would say if you're somebody that doesn't really fancy being front facing to your customers, you don't really want to make social media. You don't really want to make videos. You don't want to be coaching or anything like that making products that people are interested in, such as these quite niche products that we're gonna deep dive into, is the ideal thing for you. So let's make sure you quickly how you would actually go about and using Teespring to do that. So this is teespring.com. You would come here and open an account. Now I have an account. Every time you see the Mama Fur Fur on a video, you might see my little merchandise pop up. That's Teespring, okay? So that's part of it that you can do from this site as well. It can also integrate into usually other kind of blogging platforms quite easily and also Google storefront. So when you go into Google, somebody could search and even find your item. But let's say, for example, we wanted to sell socks. Okay, quite niche, I know, but you literally can use Teespring to start designing your own socks. Now this is pre-made socks, obviously, but let's go into one of them. And then you can actually see these are people who have actually started Started their designs and you can simply buy them. If we wanted to create our own, you would click start design up here. Once you have an account, it will then go into their product creator. 
Now, we need a design, don't we? So this is where I'm using canva.com, another great tool if you have any kind of social media business, you want to create graphics for Facebook, YouTube thumbnails, it's free. There's certainly premium product add-ons that you can you know, put onto your subscription for it, but it's free in its basic element. I love it. I make my thumbnails with it. I do a lot of stuff. And so you would actually simply start to design something. So I would usually go to, let's say, T-shirt. We can even search for that, see what suggestions it gives us. Okay, and it's got some rather kind of blank T-shirt designs that you could take these templates and then make your own. Okay, so I really love the idea of, let's say, the, the Christmassy themed ones. So let's say you maybe want to make Christmas jumpers or Christmas socks or something, okay? So this is where it's giving you some information about t-shirts, that's excellent. So we can start designing right away. And then literally you can play around with this. So let's say we want to call it, instead of Santa's little helper, you could say Santa's little reindeer, just as an example, okay? You can play around with the position Positioning. You might say, actually, I don't want snowflakes on my design, so take those away. Instead, I'm going to look for a reindeer. And so you really intuitively use this tool. We're going to go into elements and do reindeer to see if we can get a free image. Um, basically, you're looking for anything that says free on it. So there you go. This is just something really straightforward. And I can use that where it's free images, you don't pay a royalty on those. So yeah, you could always play around with the font. You can play around, as I said, with the wording. Do whatever you need to do to make this your design. And I'll make that a little bit bigger so we can fit it all in. And then eventually we could have a design that we like. Now, you don't need to use the templates. You can create it completely from scratch. Some niches that are quite popular right now is anything vegan, perhaps for dogs and cats. You know, if you're a dog lover, a cat lover, as I say, things like Christmas items, when you have maybe names, you could do something personalized for people as well. And then in Canva, they have this great option. I've used a t-shirt template as I showed you how to get there and you simply save it. Okay, so you save it as a JPEG or something like that. So I'm going to save that right now and they can actually even print it on t-shirts if you want. But what I want to do is go here and actually click the download and click as a, a PNG. Okay, so the best standard of file that we can make it. JPEG tends to be a little bit less resolution, so not as clear when you're blowing it up perhaps on fabric and clothing. So I'm going to hit download. It's going to save and then it gives me a preview of what it could look like. I actually quite like that. And then we're going to go back into Teespring. So I had my t-shirt design. What I would like to do now is actually think about putting this on, let's say a t-shirt, okay? So I would like to put it on, oh, a hoodie. Let's go for that, okay? So we're gonna go with a hoodie. Um, let's go with, yeah, let's go with that one there. We're gonna sell it. And as you can see, it's all so intuitive. I'm gonna to go to add image. We're going to go to that one there, add it right there, and then bingo. So that is how easy this all is, and you can totally play around. Perhaps you want it a little bit bigger. We're kind of moving it so that we get a little bit more of Santa's little reindeer there. And, you know, then you can put something on the back if you want, so we could actually, you know, do the same again if you wanted it to be double on the front and on the back. Super, super easy. And then literally you go through it and you could even have different colors. So maybe we want to offer black. I don't know, whatever you fancy. And then what you would do is then set the price, okay? So this is just a case of switching it to UK pounds if you're based in the UK and then deciding what you want to charge. Now it could well be you say, well, I want to make it 29 pounds, okay? And you can see you're gonna make two pounds profit then from a sale. So this is where you judge actually what pricing you want to set. But once you have it, you click, you know, continue, and then that is something on your storefront. You could actually sell these items. What you would then do is try and get eyeballs to your Teespring account. What you want to do is then perhaps start to think about social media. You could create an actual storefront and say, this is my URL, go here for my Christmas shop items. The limitless options to you are really in your favor. I really love this way of starting a nice little business. Think about family and friends. Could you do something for them? Think about everything where you could really add a lot of value. Something so simple, those two websites, teespring.com and canva.com, and you could have a drop shipping business. There's socks, there's masks, there's phone cases, you name it. A great, unique, unusual business that you could start.
Now, the next idea that you probably have not thought about as a side hustle, a passive income idea as well, that you could start from home, and I absolutely guarantee this could be a real winner for you, is actually using YouTube but we're going to use a particular website to make videos. Now, I make videos every single week. I've had my face in front of the camera for well nearly three years now, making money in finance and personal finance videos. But another way that you could actually make content is of course not using a camera and putting your face out there. Perhaps you're the type that's not really that way inclined. You actually love educating people or helping people, but you don't want to be the face of it. And here's a way this website will allow you to make YouTube videos videos okay it's a way that you can actually create content without being a person in front of it and it's called in video now I'm going to leave my link down below and if you're interested in this method in particular I want you to pay attention there's also going to be a code down below it's my affiliate code it gives you 50% off if you actually want to use in video they have fantastic packages because it's quite a complex bit of software website that you're using there is a charge unlike canva.com but if you're wanting to make video for youtube or for facebook ads for instagram for anything like that fantastic tool and actually one of the cheapest I've seen out there. So my link is down below that'll take you to really great prices and also as I say, there's a 50% off code as well. So don't say I'm not good to you. So what we're gonna do is NVIDIA from, as I say, is making YouTube videos in particular. I think this is a huge opportunity right now because we're seeing a lot more content being video based online. Google also promotes video content much easier than blogs nowadays. You know, if you think about it, the first thing I do when I'm searching, I go on Google and I go on YouTube. I want to see somebody showing me what to do. So with this idea, I truly believe people can make a lot of passive income money. You create the video once, you upload it to YouTube, you kind of work on your SEO, your optimization for getting eyeballs on it through their search engine, the right topics, what are people interested in, what could you help people with? You know, you can create videos and basically just record the voiceover for it even, or not at all, you can just have text as I'll show you. So let's actually dive in. Now why I use YouTube in particular is because when you have over over 4,000 hours of watch time a year and 1,000 subscribers, you qualify for what's called their AdSense, so basically their partnership program. On average, people make between maybe $1 right the way up to even $30, $40 per thousand views, okay? So every channel is unique. There's no guarantees about how much money you can make, but I will say with my level of subscribers, as I'm making this video right now, I'm under about 48,000 subscribers. I know it's the equivalent almost of my day job in revenue, okay? So it is a good amount of money. You put in the backbone, you build it up over maybe a year or two, and it could certainly be a really great passive income for you if you're able to put in that creative time to make videos, to look for things that people are actually wanting and interested in, and make it good quality as well. So let me talk you through this process. So the first thing you want to do is create a YouTube account, of course, that allows you to upload. What you would do is go on there, create a name for your channel based on the videos you'd like to make, or perhaps your name, and get it all set up and ready. I have a video about how to start a YouTube channel as well, particularly important since there's been a couple of changes on how to do things, so that will be down below that you can go straight to it after this video. Okay, so I'm wanting to create a video. Now here is some suggestions for you. The topics of motivational videos, law of attraction, daily inspiration are universal. I focus on money and finance and side hustles and success, but I equally know people need a lot of help with their mindset, with their health, their well-being, mental health as well. I see a lot of opportunities to make faceless great videos in those niches. They're evergreen, we call them, which means that people are constantly looking. It's not something that's only Christmas based or it's not something that's only for the summer months. They're looking for just great motivational, inspirational content. And this particular niche, I know there's a lot of viewers consistently for. So for example, when I typed in motivational video, I went down to this is the second video here, which is by Ben Lyon Scott. Okay, he's got nearly one and a half million subscribers. 
What I want to draw your attention to is this video was made two days ago and he's nearly got 100k views already. So that's pretty great. He's second in the YouTube search. So that tells us that he's ranking, people are watching that video. But I want to draw you to this fact, okay? So I'm in a thing called Social Blade. And this is where we're going to estimate, well, how much is this guy making for videos? These videos that he makes are completely faceless. It all includes maybe clips of famous people or general moving with motivational words and maybe he speaks on top. It's completely generic. Anyone could do it, although he's obviously doing it very well. So if we go into Social Blade, this is where I estimate how much they're earning, what kind of views are they getting. You can do this with anyone on YouTube. We go, notice that he's obviously based in Australia, I believe. That's what that's meant to mean there. He has over 110 million views on his channel. Incredible. He's been around for seven years, but he's only made 44 videos during that time. Incredible. I'm nearly at 300, just over 300 as I make this video. So he's doing incredible with it. He doesn't appear on the videos. He just makes them about topics, motivational topics. Now, if we look at some of the stats, this is his estimated monthly and yearly amounts. Okay, so estimated to be making nearly 18,000 pounds, just over 17,000 pounds a month. Now, what I would say is this is not an absolute about what you could achieve. Okay, I certainly know when I checked out my own values, it had underestimated me compared to what I actually get because there's no way that they are able to know your exact figures are estimating. And that's why it varies so much. I think he's probably making about half a million, dare I say it, a year from this, okay? He's doing really well, might even be closer towards that 300K, but still, that's a huge amount of money from making 44 videos in the past seven years. Now, if we deep dive, we can then see, you know, what is he likely to be making a day? He's estimated to be making well over 500 pounds a day. So that's with a couple of years of consistent effort. He's making quality. And that's why I think if you don't want to be the face in front of YouTube, there's still an opportunity for you. So to kick off, let's assume you might want to make that motivational video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to search for a suitable template. So motivational video, if we just search there, and it comes up with a whole host of different options. And you can look through, you can also create your own one, okay? You don't have to use what they're suggesting. But literally the templates are quite a good starting point for styles that you might enjoy or something that's a bit different. So let's say you wanted to start with just something really basic. So we'll go with this one this is new you go hit use templates and then it'll pull up the video editor for you now I'm not going to play around too much with this but basically it's just like Canva except it's for videos you could then play around you can put in different media so you can actually then put in I don't know something like motivational and um, look for different people that you might want to include in so we've got things to do with like people being strong scoring at the word impossible and obviously there's ways that you can then put in different videos that feel right. And these are all royalty free, depending on the package that you sign up with. So you can totally build out a video and even add your own voice over, okay? So if you feel that you've got a really great video, but you wanna talk over it, maybe put the words, really spend a lot of great time making the best video you can. And as I say, with YouTube, you create that video on end video, you then put it on YouTube, and then as you build more videos, and topics that people are interested in. For example, on you know YouTube, you might think I might want to do like a morning motivational video. So something when people wake up, there we go, 10 minutes to start your day, right? Get the inspiration for your niche that you want to concentrate on. You know, that's had 1.2 million in the past six months. So there's definitely room for getting the right videos to people. They're maybe desperate for them right now. So that's a great website using InVideo to create your YouTube channel that then you can have passive income without showing your face. Over time, you certainly can well achieve a hundred pounds, if not more. A day. So the final unique way that I would love for you to try to maybe start with passive income in your life, you might have heard me mention about audiobooks and even writing Kindle books, direct publishing from Amazon. I have a book, it's called The Master Money Blueprint. You can get your own copy or Kindle version from Amazon directly. But how about actually turning your hand at something else a little bit different? People are desperate for people who are confident to read out books to be narrators 
on those Kindle books or those other formats for them. Sometimes people don't want to read out their own books and that for that reason, I'm going to suggest this website. It's acx.com. It is an audiobook creation place, if you like. They're supplying audiobooks to Audible, Amazon and iTunes. If you've got a talent for speaking or you've got a unique accent, perhaps you're Scottish or Welsh or Irish, you've got a great English accent, whatever it is, even if you speak foreign languages as well, this is a great option for you. People are desperate, authors are desperate for you to maybe audition and speak out loud their book and bring it to life. Just imagine you're opening up books to a group of people who perhaps this is the only way to get literature is for actually hearing it or they're maybe out on a walk. They don't normally read books. You could really help them. Now, why I love this particular option for a passive income, it, there's two ways you can make money and I'll show you what to do. So if you go on to the ACX website, let's actually go and this is the option you want to choose, Titles Accepting Auditions, okay? So there's a whole host of books. We've got over 2,000 books looking for somebody to speak them out loud. Obviously what you need to do is you need to audition for them. Then if you get picked, there's two ways you can make money. The first way is with a royalty deal. That means every time that audio book is sold, you get a cut of the profits. So you could well make a lot of money very quickly. You record the book once to the certain standards that they are going to give you, and then you could keep getting paid over and over and over again. Fantastic passive income. So as I say, there's over 2000 titles right now looking for someone to speak them aloud. So let's actually deep dive into this, okay? So let's say that I want to find a book to actually make some money with. So my voice age, well, let's say I'm definitely an adult, so I'm gonna apply that. My accent we're going to say have they got they have got Scottish it is indeed it's a Glaswegian kind of an Edinburgh accent but I'm from Glasgow so I'm going to click on there okay so we've got a couple of titles seven titles are looking for a Glaswegian Scottish voice I could obviously then deep dive and see what um, gender I am so I can say female although usually it doesn't really apply too much okay it's taking it down to four so it looks in this case I could actually ha apply for four books and <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing at this title. Did you see it as well? Crappily Ever After. God bless. That's a brilliant title. Now, this particular book, you click on whichever one you're interested in, and it's a royalty share, okay? So rather than getting paid per hour, which is another way you could get paid on this site, they would simply give you maybe between like $200, even $400 for doing a book, perhaps. All depends on the length of the book. I prefer the royalty share as a passive income, though. So, for example, you can read through, this was put out, just in the past couple of months looking for somebody and it's the first fiction humor novel wonderful so it's already actually getting quite a lot of reviews it's got good average stars and they've got 400 people follow this particular lady so you know that could be certainly one that i apply for and give it a go so you would simply create an account you would audition submit a tape of you speaking a little passage for them you never know you might actually get paid you might get selected to read audiobooks and there's no limit to what you can do you know you create it once you're giving up in this case like eight nine hours of your time obviously they need to approve it as well but yeah you could be someone who gets paid to speak aloud books and that absolutely would be a great passive income for you so please do check out one of these three very unusual ideas that probably most people wouldn't think about for having passive income but i can assure you all of them as you can see you can start today it might take you six months it might take you a year to hit some major life decision moments with the money but with effort with a talent as well you absolutely could make this a passive income source for you and also do some good in the world you know whether it's speaking aloud books whether it's creating products whether even it's youtube videos there's something for everyone so if you have enjoyed today's video please do give it a thumbs up hit subscribe follow my channel and thank you so much for watching i'll see you very soon